question a lot, why do you care? Well, I care because my family is going to be black. My kids are going to be mixed. So yeah, I care about the issues. Maybe I went about it to like, oh, uh, do you know, I just asked questions and I didn't know enough about the history. That's what I'm reading. So if I'm not invited to the cookout, don't invite me to the cookout. I'm gonna be home reading. I love that anyway. My boyfriend knows I'm kind of introverted as much as people don't know that. Question. So I'm starting to wonder if this isn't at all about like, I mean, not supporting the black community because I clearly do and I know that I do. I'm wondering, is this just about the fact that my fucking man is the cutest fucking guy ever? Hi guys, I did a video on this young lady already and this is trolling at its finest. I This is expert trolling because she said she's a student of Kevin Samuels and what she's doing is causing the outrage of a lot of black women trolls on Twitter, Twitter and this is propelling her to the For You page. So this means she's going viral and she constantly goes viral because here it is, blonde, beautiful, constantly asking questions, why are black women angry? And then went on to ask why are so many black women having children out of wedlock? And now she's saying, hey, I'm gonna have a black child. I'm going to basically, um, you know have this black boyfriend which she shows and then she goes on to show and say hey you know he's the cutest now i looked at the guy and i'm not a woman and i don't um i don't know he doesn't look like a good looking guy to me but but you know what these young women these days they have different tastes than the ones back when i was growing up i mean back when i was growing up that was not the archetype i won't lie um but guess what it is what it is and that's what she likes but anyhow you know the fact of the matter is is that she's getting under the skin of a lot of women and she's triggering them and they're in her comment sections she has very little likes but she has a lot of engagement um this is just tremendous trolling now one of the things i wanted to chat about about alex and and other young ladies is we normally allow ourselves to be triggered and I'm not sure why. I always thought that after the pandemic would be over and people went back outside, they'd stop being so triggered by people who are either accidental or obvious trolls. I'm not fully sure if Alex is a accidental troll or she is an intentional troll. I don't know. Um, but what I do know is, is that wearing braids, um, asking black women a lot of different questions uh parading around a black boyfriend would tend to trigger different segments in the population and i think or or, or in the twitter followers twitter and tiktok i i definitely think that people should not allow themselves to become triggered by this i mean these people are living their lives they have preferences what does that matter to us and i mean if she wants to ask about what's happening in the black community i don't care because here's the trick of it all there's no secret what's happening in the black community uh, there is a large out of wedlock rate um on youtube especially and on twitter well twitter not so much but youtube there is somewhat of a gender war going on between some black uh, men and black some black women so it, it does give the black community a bad look uh, and it's not and let's be honest online and real life is two different things i mean online does tend to capture part of real life but it doesn't reflect real life in real life um people have f families and they take care of their families and they go about their business online people get to be anonymous and sometimes i think it's the worst side of them that comes out and especially when you have you know situations like this you know with this beautiful young lady asking these questions it will trigger them and as i said it's the old kevin samuels route that the more you the more people trolls complain and send nasty comments the more it pushes videos to become viral it is a proven formula and now i think people have figured it out and i would just say to people stop being so triggered and just if you don't like something just stop watching it simple but if it draws you into it then i think it has less to do with the content creator and more to do about yourself
Thanks, guys.